Just still talking about Halloween. It certainly is a great time to dust off a really cute mask, but not all masks are created equal, especially when it comes to COVID-19. Cleveland Clinic's doctor says it's important to remember only certain masks are proven effective in reducing the spread of the coronavirus. We know that cloth masks that have two layers of cloth are the best way to protect yourself when you're out trick-or-treating. So try to incorporate that as part of your costume. Try to find some cloth that uh, matches your costume and make your own masks. Surgical and cloth masks are often worn to help prevent COVID-19. Research suggests both types of masks are a good way to reduce expelled droplets. When it comes to cloth masks, though, Dr. England says one layer of cloth is okay, but two layers will provide better protection. It's also important to remember that a mask needs to be worn over your mouth and your nose to be most effective against coronavirus. And if you are thinking about layering masks on Halloween, don't bother doubling up. To have a mask on that is that we know that's protective uh, against transmitting COVID and then to try and put another costume mask over the top of it, it's probably not going to be an easy fit. It's going to be difficult to try to breathe in and it's just going to cut down on the amount of fun that you're trying to have on trick or treat. So let's stick with the cloth masks. Dr. England says everyone should wear a mask, even if they don't have symptoms, because some people with COVID-19 are asymptomatic but are still contagious.